What's going on, guys? Officer O'Lear here, back again at Fun Spot Kissimmee. We're with New Jersey Coasters here and uh, Scott over here. What's up, what's up? We're gonna go check out some roller coasters tonight. I think maybe grab some food, see what's up here. We're not gonna stay too long, I don't think, and just yeah, probably, check out some stuff. Parker's got a cat here. His name's Bumper. It's apparently been here almost as long as the park itself. We're walking up here past the kitty coaster, up toward Mind Blower, signature ride here. The Mind Blower is an incredible ride. It's got really good airtime. It's just a little on the rough side. It's not my favorite wooden coaster by any stretch of the imagination. I'm not really a big fan of it at all, but it's really cool and I appreciate it for what it is. In fact, here it goes right now. It's one of the first modern day wooden coasters to do an inversion. <laughs> I will be giving myself a break while them two ride it. I will let you know what they think of it when they get off. I think it's rough as hell, so I'm just gonna give my back a little break for tonight. Okay, Jason and Scott are up there in the front, I believe. Not sure, we'll have to get Jason's reaction once he gets off. Scott, Scott's been on this a bunch of times, I think, so yeah. I caught the park over the Holiday Inn. Jason, great layout. I love gravity goop. Martin Lemmix can't track. <laughs> it uh, it set off my my crash detection. Oh no. Yeah, so I had to like <laughs> cancel, cancel, cancel. It's fine. It's a rough roller coaster. The ambulance is gonna show up now. <laughs> but this ride still has like one of the just the best layouts. So I just oh yeah, it's too bad. It's a like smoother, it. a little smoother. Because you know, the trains are fun, and the layout's good. It's just I don't know why gravity goop had Martin and Lemmix do it, not them. I don't know. I don't know because gravity goop does good. Yeah, they do it themselves, I guess. Cheaper. I really can't stop appreciating it though. Still, <laughs> it's nice. It's, it's, it looks it's good. It's a great ride, but it, you know, it, it just like my brain feels. <laughs> Feel a little funny yeah. afterwards. Yeah. <laughs> Unfortunately for Jason, it looks like the high miler here is closed. Can't get Hurricane. That's too bad. I bought it because it would be cheaper to buy all the four. We are heading back into the fun spot section, and yeah, we couldn't get any credit over there for Jason. That's too bad. Yeah, I guess minus one. But we still have the Wild Mouse credit and the uh, ENF Miler Kids Coaster that's over here. That's open. We saw both of those running already, so we know they're open. Oh, but yeah. Do you feel like you're, you got a little jip there, Jason? I'm yeah. gonna post a, a Yelp review. Oh my god. Okay, yeah, well, they're charging you know, like $45 for the wristband, which is like $20 off at regular price, but still, one of the rides is closed. It's like not really justifiable how they're charging so much. But yeah, looks like Mind Blower is about to go down so we can catch it coming through.
flowing mines and back since 2017. So the uh, sky coaster here, I've mentioned this before, but it's actually the world's tallest sky coaster. It goes up about 300 feet or so. See the people getting hoisted up. I don't know if it'll focus or not. Incredible. Yeah, I'd be crapping my pants up there. Oh no. A standard DNF Miler kitty coaster over here. Jason's gonna get the credit. I actually don't have this credit, but I'm also not gonna waste my money on it. <laughs> you know, there's nobody else around, and Jason found a ride operator to let him on the kitty coaster. <laughs> He's the only one on it. What a dirty, dirty, dirty little credit horror. What the f is that? That is half a credit tech. <laughs> no, my God. Yeah, I'm like watching your car. I'm like, here they go. They're going around the disc. Wait, oh, okay. Nope. It's <laughs> regular that's the wild first mess. time that's ever happened to me. That was actually pretty fun. <laughs> oh, yeah, it's easier now, by the way. <laughs> you, wanna, you guys want to sneak another ride on the mind blower real I quick? I, I, I would love to. Okay, enjoy you it. You were talking about the go-karts. I love the go-karts. Go-karts? Go-karts, yeah. Yeah, because yeah, you got to do the, you got to do the lower tax. Who's gonna come in first place? There's the finish line. Nope, nope. Oh, Scott's in second place. That's a good that's a good finish right there. He passed Jason somehow. On the last lap, Jason was ahead of Scott. There goes Jason. It was so pissed. <laughs> Oh crap! Oh, yeah, Yo, you came in like second place there at the oh, end. Yeah, I've the raced cars all my life, so I, I, I can always be faster than anybody. <laughs> and freaking Jason's car was slow. I go. Mine was barely getting past the boat. I saw Jason like going so slow, and everybody's just like passing him. Left it, went, it went up like one mile. I go. I go. Like I, I see up behind him. I'm like, you're slow, Patty. I think Izzy's the reason this train just got sent out. I think they were waiting for people. Or maybe not. Oh yeah, no, there he is. He's in like the second row. I can see him getting thrashed around. <laughs> this ride is so violent. <laughs> Oh, this ride, this ride is so violent. <laughs> you can see it. Like, you can just watch the people's bodies as they're getting thrashed around the layout. It's incredibly intense. But that's just how these gravity group Martin and Vlemix creations always end up after a couple of years. They're really, really good out of the gate, and then they just need to be. 
No, this wasn't bad. It was just a little rougher than usual. It, this is just ridiculous now. <laughs> oh, man, they had to do interviews. Like, right, well, theory, like, we're on the way back now, but yeah, that was a fun time at Fun Spot. <laughs> Thank you guys for watching, and I'll talk to you in the next video. Peace out.